the Obama administration to destroy America, take away our guns, and force us all to be Muslim. Thank you. That was good. Um, <laughs> Thank you, Ms. Beef. Okay, so for my book report, I read Romeo plus Juliet equals. You mean Romeo and Juliet? Oh, right, totally, yeah. Michael, do you want to tell us about Romeo and Juliet? Oh, word, word, for real. Okay, so. <laughs> Alright, so like it takes place in this city, right, called. Verona, right? But it's so cool, I like to call it Verona. So, you know what I'm saying? Wee, 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 wee. <laughs> for real, for real. All right, and it stars this guy. His name's uh, Romeo, but he's like super cool, so I like to call him Romeo Sully. Wee, 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 wee. <laughs> Michael, will you please stay on topic? Oh, uh, yo, Miss B, I'm so sorry. Yeah, no disrespect, but like you're a beautiful lady, and I respect you and everything you do, and like you're a great teacher, and I love you. Thank you so much, Miss B. <laughs> it's very nice, Michael, yeah, but can you please, please just get back to me. Totally, totally. Okay, so uh, so like, there's this guy, Leonardo DiCaprio, right? And he's like really into this girl, uh, Rosalind, right? And he's all like... Leonardo DiCaprio? My B, uh, Romeo. Okay, so <laughs> Romeo is this guy, and he's really into Rosalind, right? But she's like not into him back, so he's like totally bummed right now, right? Yo, Rosalind, you mega fly. Stop fell has the hottest body in the land. We should totally hang out sometime. Maybe like a joust and chill sesh, if you know what I'm saying. Joust and chill, because you're totally not as hot or as cool as I am. And your feelings totally matter. Romeo, my man, what's up? Oh, what's up, Mercutio, my dude? Man, you know, Ross here, she's telling me that I'm totally lame. She doesn't appreciate how hot I am. Ugh. Don't sweat her, bro. We can go to the Capulet Banger tonight, and we can find you a new lady. You've always got my back, Mercutio. I love you, man. <laughs> so, like, Romeo and Mercutio and, like, all their homies, bro, like, hella deep to this party, right? And uh, Romeo's not having a good time because he's, like, still hung up on Rosalind and everything. So, like, but it changes because this girl, Juliet, is at the party. And, dude, if you thought Rosalind was hot, Juliet is, like, a mega, super, ultra hot hottie. So, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Your sister's hot. That's who's hot for real. <laughs> ah, nah, you cool, you cool. Uh, so, anyway, it's kind of awkward, though, right? Because, like, uh, she's 13 and stuff, and it's kind of weird. But it's hot, so it's cool. Don't worry about it. But the thing is, they can't fall in love because their families hate each other. So it's really weird. And Romeo is being a little bit of a creep, and he's, like, listening to her on the balcony and everything. Romeo, Romeo, where art thou, Romeo? You look really hot and so sweet, I always mm. felt like we should hang out sometime. Thanks, you know, I appreciate my sweet ass too. You're hot, let's chill. Totally. <laughs> now, it's sweet that like Romeo and Juliet are trying to be together and stuff, but not everyone's cool with that. So like, uh, especially because Romeo had to like kill this dude, but it's like, he's all like, nah, because I got to marry Juliet and everything. Hey, we should totally get married like tonight. Cool. <laughs> Juliet's parents totally hate this, and they make him marry. They make her marry Paul Rudd, but she hates it, so she fakes her own death. Ju <laughs> Romeo comes in, doesn't know Juliet's not really dead, and tries to kill himself with the poison. For real, he kills himself, Paul Rudd, and everyone's dead except for Juliet. Damn, it looks like everyone's dead. I guess I should die too. <laughs> Duh, and